gonna concentrate as much of my poke as I can on Kassadin as possible. There we go. Thousand gold shutdown on the Ash. Perfect. This could be huge. We win this the rest of this fight too. Perfect. Okay, this could be a Baron. We need to go straight to Baron, ignore everything else. Yo, what up gamers, you're watching video number 50 of my Iron Thermosity series. Make sure to subscribe if you want to see the rest of the series, and follow me on Twitch if you want to see the series live. The link is in the description. Oh shit. That was a way big overstep from Lux. So I've done three damage with cut down to somebody. I'm not sure who that was, but something. Ah, oh, fuck. I'm missing somebody else. That's here, my bad. We'll start E. This requires a steady hand. There he goes, top side. I'm missing far too much lost hits, man. Oh. Gonna heal early? Yeah, they do have ignite, so. Let's well do that early in case they want to try and go for a call. Wait, how did I get plus 13 magic damage there? Does one of not his abilities actually give me more, like, on hit? I never knew that, if that's the case. One thing I also want to be focusing on is uh, removing Misfortune's first strike whenever it's up. So I want to just throw out a W at her every time. Ensure that she's not able to get the gold from that in lane. Yeah, so she wants to go aggressive on Misfortune, sure, but... Ow. You want me to flash on her or what? Oh, Viego is still topside, what? Our first strike is up, I'm throwing out the W, and I missed. Nice. Got her that time. Wanna disengage now that I'm getting minion aggro? Yeah, I was actually gonna use my E, but I just saw Viego. We don't have to back, but we do need to play some vision now. Because we've known Viego's position for so long, I'm actually just sitting on two trinkets right now. But that, don't ward there. <laughs> May seem kind of useless to play some ward right now where we have the scuttle anyway, but this will run out soon. This ward is fucking useless because we can we have time to ward in the river. Uh, are they backing? They might be. They were pretty low. We want to crash this ASAP. And if they're not here, then I back. Yeah, I mean, she can go for that. She can cash in her stacks, but there's no point in me trying to go for this plating. It would be way too greedy. I'd miss farm because of overstaying. We'll get most of our mana back and then we can leave. We don't need to wait for the entire mana bar to be restored. Who's the lowest base HP as an ADC? It used to be Zeri. I don't know if she still does. She might be tied with Caitlyn or she might have a little bit more now. But uh, at level 1 used to be Caitlyn for sure. And uh, then after her, Zeri. Which makes them better cutdown users than other ADCs. Ugh. 
Can we fight her? I guess we can. Diggle's kinda low. Oh, Lee. <laughs> Wait, shit, I fucked up my pathing really hard here. Oh no. I should have flashed ages ago. Maybe too late now. Yep, my bad. That sucks. I needed to path through here. Thought I, I could actually be with Renata at least. I just forgot that it was turning into Lee Sin was the issue. <laughs> If I, uh, I, cause if I thought that it was just, if it, if it was just Viego, then that would have been fine. But I forgot he could just fucking war jump here and kill me. What is the difference between taking three pots versus refillable? Refillable gives you less sustain immediately, but uh, basically allows you to scale uh, more effectively or faster by having you spend less gold in the long run because usually when you start three uh yeah when you start three potions you will typically get a refillable later on anyway so by starting refillable gives you you know slightly weaker laning phase early on but uh you don't have to spend or you save on that 150 gold and by going straight into refillable okay they, they only just back so we should probably have time to crash this wave in make them miss some farm We can also start hitting the plating. And easy as well, try and get a feel for Viego's location. Yeah, he's moving to the top side, nice. Won't be bottling for a while then. <clears throat> Alright, Frosty, thanks so much for the ramps up, man. Appreciate that. Would've been so good if I dodged that Luxie as well. Oh god. This could be really good though. Okay, nice. Holy shit. Oh, so the- Oh, the Renata thingy gets extended when you get kills. I knew that about the- uh, When you're reviving from it. Kind of didn't think about the fact that the- uh, You'd be able to have it on you longer so you can spend more time able to be revived. That's really nice. Could have played that more aggressively then, because uh, they were guaranteed to die there. The same alchemy the way though, as you can see. The big was top. So I probably should have just focused these melees. Because it's not a disaster. Okay, nice. Not a disaster if you leave the casters alive there. They're, they're like so far back that they don't cause your mini wave to not crash into the turret. But the melees are more like in front. Gosh, you better not cancel me here. Thank God. Okay. Yeah, the melees are more in front. So if you start off with the casters and then you move on to the melees, and then it turns out that you get zoned off and you can't finish the melees, they kind of create a freeze. So you would much rather just kill the melees first. And then if the enemies have to zone you off, it's not an issue at all if you just have to leave the casters alive. Thanks for the guides, bro. No problem, man. Glad you like them. No, I had no idea you were high diamond, Panda. For strike for her. Can I remove this on my own? I think I can. They're too far away. Or are they? Nah, I can't actually. Oh, what? 
Oh man, okay. Shit, I didn't see Viego with my E. I didn't think about it, the fact that it could still be bot side though. Not bad. I even uh, backed off, gave them the respect and didn't greet for the pink. Super unfortunate that Viego was there. In that exact position at that exact time. I don't know why Renata roamed top though, that was really random. I guess it was an okay timing though, I just didn't expect it. Because as a support, you definitely you don't want to roam ever when the wave is pushing like away from your ADC, like pushing towards here. But we, because we'd already crashed it and it was going to be bouncing back, theoretically if she wants to roam there, I'm not going to miss too much farm for it. Oh, I was actually, I was going to use my E to uh, cancel one of their backs with my ult, but she just back in vision anyway. Oh wow, dude. This is so doomed. Hey, Rome definitely taking too long now, Renata. Ah, oh, damn it. Oh, she might actually be dead here, though. If I'm lucky. Nah, she flashed. Renata, why are you trolling me? My bad, though. I could have acknowledged the fact that uh, Viego could just be bot side. I was, I was distracted talking to chat. Yeah, we were stomping lane and now just getting stomped. Fucks. Oh, why did Ori go bot? I'll go mid, I guess. Needs to be difficult to win this one. Not so much. I mean, I can get carried here easily. Although, Cassidy might be an issue. But at least Lee and Clet are pretty strong as well. Oh, I'm dead here. <laughs> My bad. <laughs> not for healing. Shit. I'm not focused enough. My bad. Wasn't thinking about where Kassadim might be. Yeah, I mean, there's no reason for the swap. I don't know why Ori went bot. She wasn't gonna get any farm that I couldn't get. It's really random. She's not. She's gonna lose this third one v two as well. Oh god. Okay. Oh, oh my god. She just barely lives. Did I try and sniper? Hmm. Now she's gonna be too healthy now. Could maybe try on one v two, but I would need to bait them, they're not just gonna... Yeah, I need to try and bait them into thinking they can win this fight. Which means making it so they can nearly win this fight. But they're not falling for it, so yeah, okay. Just forcing a flash from B2. I don't know how much better I could have baited it, really. <laughs> nah, but okay, the is actually trolling, that's why she swapped. There's no reason for her to be going bot when I'm already here. Okay, it's a hard game to win if they're gonna be trolling for sure. <clears throat> Together we are strong. Together we are Avarosa. An ally has been slain. Oh boy. Rampage. Shut down. Dead. Okay, he's got her. Now nah, there's a way to hemp. Ugh, give me up. But what? Renata's actually trolling, so there's no reason for her to be that far back, and she knows it. Oh wait, no, I can't let it kill me, because I won't be able to kill him fast enough. Ah, oh, cast him, my bad. And I'm down to vote yes with two trolls.
But the fact, with Cassidy being so strong and uh, them also having Lux, I'm just gonna do with Sun's second item. Oh shit. <laughs> yeah, I only just thought, uh, wait, where's Cassidy? Right as he covered Renata. Now oh, we can't be pushing there. He can get on us too easily. Even if it was 1v2, he would still kill us. Oh, she almost dodged that by stopping to auto leave. <laughs> but damn. Very nice. Yeah, I just have I have to leave this wave and just go group with Ori because uh, Cassidy, for all I know, is just sitting in this brush waiting for somebody to farm. Until we know where Cassidy is, just have to leave mid lane. Convert to back mid. Can he not tax everything as he's passing by though? There's nowhere in position to capitalize on that, but shit. <laughs> they both flashed out, come on man. Okay, we see Cust in this bot lane. Ah, oh, still a uh, vehicle though. That's fine. Uh, there's a cast behind us, and I don't have ult to deal with him. Oh god, that is no intention of uh, healing him off of me. Well, at least Cloud lives. Hopefully. Oh, whoa, okay. Especially dead though, right? God damn. Okay, can Cloud carry this? Suddenly. Ah, I don't quite have the burst. That's a zero mana, but as soon as he gets to a minion, he'll recover some. Okay, I gotta go mid. I need to take risks this game. Ah, and I just straight up missed that wall. Even if that hit though, that was still a really, really risky thing to do when I didn't have vision of the rest of the team. But I think it might have worked out actually, because we did see, we proceeded to see Lux and Viego here. Might have actually just straight up been a kill for free, because you've extended. 
She thought that I wouldn't go for that, because really it wasn't a smart move, but... Just, uh, the game to make desperation plays. <laughs> this guy sucks at securing his caps, man, holy- He just handed me both. Holy shit. <laughs> that was fucking funny. Oh no. I don't know, we're not- we're not expected us to do there. I'm gonna concentrate as much of my poke as I can on Kassadin as possible. There we go, 1000 gold shutdown on the Ash, perfect. This could be huge. We win this. the rest of this fight, too. Perfect. Okay, this could be a Baron. We need to go straight to Baron, ignore everything else. Not even the mid wave. Fuck it. Fuck it. Don't touch it. Don't touch it. Why waste time, man? Just go straight to Baron. Oh, God. Fine. She gets one blunt. Whatever. Just Baron. I'm gonna cancel her back. Cause she might TP. Wait, fuck, if I revealed this area as well, the minions would have interrupted her back as well. Oh well, my bad. <coughs> Let's hope we don't need my ultimate in the next 50 seconds anyway. It will do against Sue's third for maximum damage against the Kassadin. Against that being buddy, really. Probably Lord Dominic's fourth will be, be uh, will be good after that. They got quite a bit of armor. One kill. Nice. If uh, Kassadin shows up now, it's still gonna be a 4v4 rather than a 4v5. Thanks to that pick on Lux. Oh god. No! Talk about the worst fucking synergy, man. Holy shit. Oh my god. Just fucking got him. Aw, oh, team. No. <laughs> Renata is so far behind as well. She didn't realize for so long that we were turning. My god. Look how far away she was, even though she started off with the rest of the team, man. We should have just all turned, because otherwise, uh, Kassadin just chases us down. I guarantee I die there if uh, I don't go in. <clears throat> Remember in the video you were talking about Ginsu's, doesn't it cancel our passive? Uh, it does uh, prevent her getting the double crit slow. And also, yeah, it doesn't uh, remove the extra crit damage, except for the base 10% that she already has. That being said, if, it, if you're going to be building with Synth, then it just combos really well with that. And it also makes it so, like, you may lose your passive in terms of the increased damage. Oop. Ah, fuck. A red buff up. But, uh, it does also make it so your first hit, which is usually reduced damage on Ash, because you haven't parked your passive on that opponent yet. We should try and get her. Yeah, and I need to concentrate on this. <laughs> My god. There we go, another big shot down. Oh god. 
Yeah, I'm gonna be dead here, but... Oh, am I? Oh, wow. He, he needed to commit, man. Too unlikely that it gets out there. He needed to trade one for one. Because now I'm not even dead. That's huge. What do they all leave? He can't outrun Kassadin? Yeah, exactly. But he couldn't 1v4. That was my logic for turning. But I needed everyone to turn with me. Worst part is, like, if Renata, I think... I think if Renata just turned when the rest of my team did, didn't, even if uh, the rest, all of them had turned, like, too late to save me, at least Kassadin would have gone down. But Renata was just continuing to walk away while Leeson and Kled were all going in. And I was already going in before that. We should be able to get this down real quick before Cassidy gets in range, I hope. Yeah, easily. Just back now, though. Castle's losing his lead. I don't know about that one, buddy. This is a really shit spot to me for me to fight in. Working out though. Thank God. Like I had no idea if I was gonna get flanked by Castle from anywhere. If the custom randomly popped out from here, I was fucked. I can try and go for one of them here. Oh, nice. Ooh, that was, that was a waste of a cloud ult. Could have waited until we killed Misfortune before using it. Or until she flashes away. Still, uh... They need to defend us here, or they lose. If they don't... If they aren't able to uh, kill us here, I think they are... We are just gonna end. Okay, nice, we're not ult. Nice, dude. Oh my god. The Ori no longer trolling. Unleashed. I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. Make sure to like and subscribe to see the rest of this series. And follow me on Twitch if you want to see this series live. The link is in the description. Like I said, this isn't actually the harder game for me. All I have to do is get carried by Lee and Kled. <laughs> I just have to do damage. My game, my role in this game was not hard at all. Once I, started, once I stopped trolling and dying to the castle for no reason. <laughs>